Joss is our stamp of approval. Going back to that light that Matt was talking about, when we started this business, we tested over about 500 products and they came in ebbs and flows. I mean, you talking about gummies that had zero CBD that cost $70 or um, something else that may said 1,000 milligrams. It came back at 400. So we knew right then and there that the COAs that came on a lot of products weren't necessarily true. Some were, some weren't. Majority were probably inaccurate. Uh, so we implemented here at uh, the CBD Center fourth party testing. So in order to get product on our shelves, got to be American grown, non GMO, and um, grown with organic practices. After they check those boxes, we send it off to our independent testing in Rhode Island. We utilize the two local labs and uh, we verify that's actually what's on the bottle is in the bottle. And I think that when that is true and it's a clean product, that these products have efficacy. And the whole reason why CBD was brought forward and made legal in the United States is because of its efficacy with seizures, particularly children's, uh, Javette syndrome and uh, Lennox Gastel. But uh, we see it on an everyday basis. There's a big lack of you know, medical studies and trials, but sit in our shop, see the people come in, hear the real results, and uh, I'm proud to be doing this with uh, somebody who we grew up together playing hockey and that we can make a big difference and uh, really bring CBD to light um, in Rhode Island.